hatchet of yours. It seems to get stuck pretty easily. It's gonna get you killed. Here, use this. Very effective. We can do this. Okay, just, just calm down. They don't sound too good. Clock is ticking. I'm ready. I know you are. We need to get a better look. Get away! How about you get the close one, and I'll hop the fence to get the other. Go Roger. Not like this. You can't do this. Hello. I can't help you if you. I can't help you if you don't. Nice work. You know what you're doing. Now watch this. Got a nice little addition to your Leave arsenal. Me alone. Take out the knees first, then put a knife in the back of its head when it's down. All right, let's get a look at what we've got on deck. Get up. Hold on, let me just put one in this one real quick. Glad you're paying attention. See, I listen, you know, half the time. It's gonna take some work to get over there. No! There's too many. We're not getting in while they're still hanging out over there. Maybe we can get them to move. Nada. Yeah, most of these guys are gonna have nothing on them. But it's worth taking a look when it's not too risky. Deal with these fuckers. Hello there, sir. How is your knee? So screw you. You did the knee thing. Nice trick, huh? Come on. That's a lot of walkers. That all got I swear one had a helmet on there. And what gets the interest of the dead? Noise. What the hell? How do we get in? If we can make enough noise on this side, we can lure those yeah, yes. over here. It's got a helmet. Then we might just be able to go through that other trailer and get to your friends. What do you think of that? If you think that's best, I'm with you. Good. What's going to grab their attention? Okay. Well, maybe the car that had the green hand. <laughs> Punch the TV. That'll do it. Keep it going somehow. Agreed. Let me just back on out of here a second and see if I can find anything. Maybe if you put a walker on it. What are you thinking? We lean him on the horn. It'll keep honking and draw the walkers. Sure, I'm not. Just like moths to a flame. Give me a hand. What are you doing? Why are you doing this? Come on, almost there. That got the fuckers. Come on. 
Uh -huh, you can't get me. Come on. Uh oh. Crap. We gotta move it. Then try something else. You're gonna need to use more force than that. Put some muscle into it. I'll hold them off. Just get us in there. Damn. Hurry. Get out of my way, door. Help me block this. Hurry. <laughs> I'm in my hand, I like to scratch my chin for one second. Sir, please. Who's out there? Luke! Clem? Oh, thank God. Did Nick find you? He made a run for it. Looking for help. I... I saw him outside. Look, he was out there. But we took care of him. You know. Fuck. Fuck. When I heard y'all banging through the door... Luke! Are you all right? I'm, uh, I'm walking. Can't do much else, though. Sarah, she's another story. I, I don't know what to do about her. What's the matter? You gotta help. Sarah, look. Look, it's Clem. See, it's just like I told you. They're, they're okay. Sarah, come on. We, we have to go now. Come on. We need to get out of here. Guys, we can't do this. We can't, we can't, we can't stay here. I don't know what to do. I can't snap her out of it. Okay, I tried to carry her, but I, I guess Carver messed me up pretty good back there. I don't know. It was just after Carlos, she just lost it. Started running through the woods like a maniac. I, I chased her for I don't know how long, and then while well, she saw this mobile home made a beeline right for her. I'm just glad y'all are here. We gotta way. hurry. What are we gonna do about her? Maybe she'll listen to me. Maybe. Listen, I uh, they're gonna tear this place open pretty soon. We can't stay, so we, we gotta get her up, or, or we gotta. Yep. Well, I've been trying. I've been trying for hours. I can barely get her to look at me. Clem. Let's see what's the options. Sarah, it's me. Give me options. Hi. I need you to listen to me, okay? It's important. I know how you feel right now. It's one of the worst feelings in the world. Ever since the walkers, so many people I know have died. People I love. And for stupid reasons. Crap, we're surrounded. What? What about the skylight? Oh, we got. Clem, there's no time. Clem. Listen, Jane might be right. When everything started, I met my friend Lee. He tried to help me find my parents. He protected me more than anyone else in my whole life. He died to keep me safe. I was so scared. But you're still here. Because he taught me to be strong, even when I'm scared. Because he wanted me to live. And your dad protected you because he wanted you to live. He would still want that. Get these glasses on. We're getting the fuck out of here. Get to the skylight now. Come on, I'll boost you. Uh, What's damn. going on back there? My ribs. We're gonna need something to stand on. Luke, get over here. Help me hold this. Clem, 
See what you can find. Big can brain time. It's not big enough. The fridge. Forget it. That thing ain't budging. Find something else. Oh god damn it. Can we use that? Yeah, that would work. What would work? Oh shit. Okay. Ready? On three. One, two, three. Push like shit. Spamming Q. Uh oh. Clem! Clem, help her! Help Jane! Dun 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 dun. Okay, go, go! Keep pushing! Go! Okie dokie. Push, 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 push! Oh, I'm a host. Almost. Gotcha. You first. We need you up top. Hurry the fuck okay, up. Come on. Clem. Sarah, we have to go. Are you listening? I can't do it. Now, God damn it. Clementine, if she doesn't want to go, you can't make her. Don't let her take you down too. Not again. I can't. I can't. I can't. Out of it, Sarah. Please. You can't save her, Clem. We have to go. Believe me. I know about this. Hurry up. <gasps> wakey, wakey, bitch. <gasps> Clementine, grab her. <sighs> Sorry for calling you a bitch, but... I had to wake you up go. somehow. Sarah. Come on. How the hell can I still hear him smashing the door down? Are we there yet? I've got the sounds glitched. Look, Sarah, you can get through this. We both will. But I'm not okay. Just try. Can you do that? She just needs a little time, Clem. Leave her be for a bit. I don't know about this. The way she is, she's gonna cause problems. What happened in there? When we went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. Look, I just... I'd seen that kind of thing before. I just didn't want to stick around for the bitter end. Sorry, I... I don't mean to sound harsh. It's just the way things are. <laughs> it's okay, I get it. Things aren't always simple. And just because you got her out of there today, doesn't mean you saved her. Trust me. I tried to save Jamie too, but she gave up. I just... I can't believe it. As soon as you guys said go, I was the first one up on the roof. Like I had already made up my mind. Luke, you can't let it eat away at you. Well, I can't forget it. I dragged my sister across four states. And every morning, she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her. Or push her. Or goddamn carry her if I had to. Until this time... Walkers cornered us. Forced us up to the roof. And, and when they kept coming, I... I couldn't make her jump. Couldn't throw her. So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted. And I left her there. Jumped to the next building over by myself. You left your sister? Jane, I'm really sorry. I 
killed me for a long time. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march through hell, when all she really wanted was for me to let her go. Sarah was that way, too. Jane? No regard for her own safety. Or ours. Come on. Let's get back to your friends. Son of a bitch. You found him? Yeah, I'm a little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane, well, I don't know what would have happened. Sarah, how you doing, hon? That's okay, sweetie. Whenever you're ready, I'm just glad you're here. But wait. Wait, where's Nick? Uh, Rebecca, how about we, uh, we go for a walk for a minute? Let's just give him some space. I have something I need to talk to you about, too. No. No. <laughs> I ain't gonna sugarcoat this. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. But I was hoping you might know, does Luke know anything about babies? Has he, I don't know, mentioned Carlos teaching him anything? Kenny had a family. He could help. Where is he? He brought Sarita in there not long after you left. I don't know if he's... Done it yet. I ain't seen him since. I don't think he's doing well. I've seen him like this before. That's why I was thinking you could talk to him. I think if it's just you, someone he knows well, you might be able to get through to him. And I wouldn't ask you to do it if it weren't for the baby. <sighs> Guess I got no choice. You know, the fucker told me to fuck off. I better go in there and talk to him. Creepy ass birds. Wilma, I'm home. Kenny? Could you please come out? What the hell's the point? She didn't want me to wait, but I had to. In case by some crazy chance, she didn't come back. Sarita was a good person. I liked her. You know what it feels like to get beaten almost to death? Peaceful. It feels peaceful. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. And then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beating. Every day. Duck. Katja. Sarita. No peace. No rest. The punches just keep coming. Why the hell couldn't Carver have just finished me off? Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. That baby's almost here, and Rebecca needs your help. Yeah, I guess she does. Now, nah, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. Hadn't killed me yet, anyway. Maybe one of the others can look at it for you. Oh shit, does that mean what I think it does? What are we supposed to do? 
We should see what's going on. Are you okay? How does it feel? It feels wet. That's how it feels. What's going on? Rebecca's water broke. Mm. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. Well, what do we do? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca trap her like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. This place doesn't seem safe for a baby being born. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Sarah? Sarah? You just stay here with Rebecca and Kenny, okay? Clem... I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mac a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking... How do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. I trust Jane. Yeah. I mean, I would have never made it back without her. Just something to think about. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfectant. That all sound right? Yeah, I'll go with that. Go with Jane. Better hurry and catch up then. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast, and let's be careful. Chris hadn't done the museum way before. Oh, did I just...